Dear folks, I'll take your page number 66 to 69. Uh, this is American Action Training Book, R, American Way. In US, the letters R, L, and the are the letters which are considered to be troublesome and difficult for the non-Americans or non-Britishers to pronounce. Like Indians, we find it difficult to pronounce R, L, and the three most important letters. Uh, unlike other letters like P, M, B, etc., the R sound is not to be seen. Uh, dear friends, take your page number 66 and 69 in Action Training Book. It is R, American way. Uh, it is always said once if you know to pronounce R, you are considered to be half American. Once you are able to pronounce R in proper manner, you are considered to be half American or half Britisher. See here, in US the letters R, L and the are the letters which are considered to be troublesome. So we, uh, we find it difficult for to follow the Britishers or Americans uh, with their words like R and, and the and difficult for the non-Americans and non-Britishers to pronounce unlike other letters like P, M, B, etc. The R sound is not to be seen from outside. Here B, B, P and M are rounder, are sounded by putting our lips together, but the R sound is produced behind the closed lip and from the throat. R is produced from the throat. If anyone speaks, we can hear only R. The R sound is made by folding our tongue and the R sound should be produced from the throat. See here, how do you, pro how do you pronounce the R sound? Keep your hand flat. First, you keep your hand, fa hand flat. Now, second, the palm facing up and straight. The palm is facing up and straight. The open straight is the position of your tongue. Imagine this is your tongue making the sound ah. When you keep your hand like this, it is facing up. This is your tongue. When you keep your tongue, you should say, keep your tongue. Ah, this is your tongue is in the position ah. Now you should go from ah to ah sound. Here you should take your fingers and round them as you say ah. Should pass from the hollow region of your middle of the tongue. So this is the tongue. When you have this tongue in this position, you say ah. When you want to say ah, you fold the tongue ah. So, the sound should be produced here in between. So, R, 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 R. So, this is how you have to pr uh, produce the sound R. Now, here coming back, try the harsh sound by using both of your hand and your tongue at the same time. Now, keep your both the hands together and say with your hand flat and round your tongue as you say R. So, R. So, round your tongue as you say R. The tip of the tongue should move to the middle position of your mouth, but it should not touch any part of your mouth. Your tongue should not touch any part of your mouth. It should round and in the middle part the R sound should come. Here practicing R sound in a word. See girl, girl, you ro roll up your tongue. It should not touch anywhere. More, church, dear, Sir, carry, area. Now, practicing is R sound after tense vowels. Practicing R sound after tense vowels. Tense vowel means what? You are pulling the vowel here. So, you pull this, it is called tense. If you, if you shorten it, it is called lax. When you pull the vowel sound, then it is called tense. If you shorten it, it is lax. Now, here, here, more, what? So, you pull the vowels, then after that R comes, you are sounding the R. The R sound which confuses and gives trouble to you. What are the R sounds which troubles you? Where? Where are? Where? Now, pronounce after me. Say everybody together marriage, necessary, dictionary, marry. Theory, heroine, America, stir, cause, ours. So, read the following passage below. You see, 
how many hours are here raju raju cholen say everybody together raju raju cholen um was a great emperor was a great emperor who ruled tamil nadu exactly 1000 years back in tanjore he built a great temple which is a wonderful archaeological masterpiece the entire temple is built on stones without any bricks he ruled almost the entire south india his son's name was rajendra cholen there were no stone quarries near tanjore so rajaraja cholen must have got the huge stones to build a temple which were 60 km away from tanjore temple area he celeb- celebrated we celebrated the 1000 uh, anniversary of tanjore temple last month that's in the month of october 2010 <coughs> so nanbargale ipolud paathina pakkam 66 irundu 69 eluthukalile miga mukhyamana eluthu r l the inda r eluthu miga miga mukhyam inda r ai seriyaga ucharithina half american alladhu half britisher endru solvargal appo inda r endra eluthu miga miga mukhyamaga ubayogapadathapadigirathu இந்த ஆறு எல் த இந்த மூன்றையும் நன்றாக உச்சரிக்க தெரிந்து விட்டால் உங்களுக்கு எந்த விதமான குழப்பமும் இருக்காது இந்த ஆறை எப்படி உச்சரிக்க வேண்டும் என்றால் இந்த நாக்காக நினைச்சு கொள்ளுங்கள் உங்கள் நாக்கு வாயில் இப்படி நேராக வைக்கும்போது ஆ என்று சொல்ல வேண்டும் இர் என்று சொல்லும்போது ஆ நாக்கை மடக்கி நாக்கினுடைய அந்த முனைப்பகுதி எங்கும் தொடாமல் இந்த குழிக்குள்ளேயே ஆ என்று சொல்ல வேண்டும் இப்படியாக ஆர் உற்பத்தி பண்ணப்பட வேண்டும் இங்கே பார்த்தீங்கன்னா ஆர் சவுண்ட் எப்படி சொல்லுவீங்க கேர்ள் மோர் சர்ச் டியோர் சர் கேவரி ஏரியா ஹியர் மோர் வாட் வே வேர் மேவரேஜ் நெசரி டிக்ஷனரி மேவரி ஹேவரி ஹீரோயின் மேவரிகா ஸ்டோர் ஹா ஜாஸ் என்று சொல்கிறோம் அடுத்ததாக ராஜராஜ சோழனுடைய ஆயிரம் ஆண்டு கால நூற்றாண்டு விழாவை பற்றி நாம் பேசுகிறோம் இங்கே ஆரை பற்றி எப்படி சொல்லுவீங்க ராஜ் ராஜ் சோழன் வாஸ் எ கிரேட் எம்பர் உருள் தமிழ் நாடு எக்ஸாக்ட்லி தௌசண்ட் இயர்ஸ் பேக் ஆயிரம் ஆண்டுகளுக்கு முன்னாடி தஞ்சாவூரில் ஆண்டவன் ராஜ ராஜ சோழன் இன் தஞ்சாவூர் யூ பில்ட் எ கிரேட் டெம்பிள் விச் இஸ் அ வண்டர்ஃபுல் ஆர்கியாலஜிக்கல் மாஸ்டர் பீஸ் த என்டை டெம்பிள் என்டை டெம்பிள் இஸ் பில்ட் ஆன் ஸ்டோன்ஸ் வித்வுட் எனி பிரேக்ஸ் he ruled almost the entire south india his son's name was rajendra cholan there were no stone quarries near tanjore so raja raja must have got the huge stones to build the temple which were 60 km from the tanjore temple area he celebrated the 1000 anniversary of tanjore temple last month so that's uh that's in the month of october 2010 so in the r engira eluthai seriyaga ucharikka therundal neengal pramadamaga unga pechangilam nandraga irukkum thank you